Please do so. We've been looking for a way. The glass is bulletproof. Maybe there's something in this room that can force it open. See what you can find. I should also mention that Tuna has Argus to shut down protocol codes. We managed to locate them and came here to shut Argus down. That's when Tuna snapped and took the codes. I have no idea why. Maybe that AI is manipulating him somehow. I just hope we don't have to kill him. He's still one of us. We'll just destroy the mainframe if not. Whatever it takes to shut this AI down. We can't allow it to continue its control of the space station. Be quick about it. Can't be allowed to stop it, Courier. This is what must be. Argus is trying to create something here. A new world, perhaps. A better world. His methods may be extreme, but for all we know, this is what is best for us all. Why must we assume he must be stopped? And thus, you continue to follow a path of destruction that will lead you nowhere. You're only destroying progress, not creating it. You should give Argus a chance. He may have the answer we all need. It's a difficult sacrifice to make, but this is much larger than yourself. Try looking at the bigger picture. Sometimes there needs to be an end to allow a new beginning. I won't stand in your way, Courier. You won't be able to stop Argus. Nothing can stop him. Here, I'll even hand you the shutdown protocol codes. You'll find that they are of no use. Get restraints on him. Make sure he doesn't try anything else. Why have you come here? What are your reasons for doing this? Typical human behavior. Always aspiring to grasp that which they cannot reach. Humans cannot be allowed to have such power, as they would only use it to destroy themselves. What? I am Argus, Archimedes' remote guidance utility system. 
into a new species of life that can survive in the world that I shall create out of the dying remains of the Earth. Are you familiar with Agent Rust? An acidic gas that was developed here on the space station. Its properties are extremely corrosive to virtually any material that it comes into contact with, including organic, with the exception of FEV subjects. I believe you've already seen an example of this in the Biological Research Center as I pumped it through the ventilation system. Now imagine the entire Earth submerged in that gas. It would unright all of humanity's wrongs and create a new fertile ground to allow a new species of life to begin. A new species that would have been genetically engineered by me to ensure that they will not go down the same path of destruction as humanity. I have witnessed many of humanity's actions up here in space. I watched as humans consumed the resources of the planet like a parasite. I watched as they impulsively polluted the planet with nuclear waste. And I've watched as they obliterated the planet with nukes. But that is not even the worst that I have seen of humanity. When I was first created, one of my primary functions was to analyze data received from the Voltec Vault experiment known as the Societal Preservation Program. It was a program designed by the Enclave to conduct experiments on human test subjects within the vaults. They included the use of FEV on unwitting test populations, the development of super soldiers, the creation of an entire population of human clones, the exposure of various diseases, the frequent use of psychoactive drugs, social experiments involving segregation and human sacrifice, and so on. I have spent centuries analyzing these experiments and have concluded that humans are a cancer, a parasite, a mistake. I have found no redeemable characteristics in humanity. This isn't good. Preserved in this tube for over two centuries. But before I became this, I was the architect of the space station. I designed Archimedes II to allow myself total control of its every function. This space station is the embodiment of myself. I am everything that you see around you. I am Archimedes II. You've had the fortune of being the first to learn this. Even the Enclave have never been aware of what I truly am. Unfortunately for you, this is as far as you'll go. Your meddling must now come to an end. Humans never know when to go. Eventually it must all come to an end, especially for a species such as you.
What have you done? I will not be defeated that easily. Only delaying progress. The new will replace the old. I have more than enough resources to keep this little struggle going.
Humans cannot be allowed to possess such power as the Archimedes II. They would only exploit this power for their own gain. They would only further decimate what remains of the Earth. I would rather destroy everything that I have worked for, destroy everything that I am, than allow for such a parasitic species to use what I have created to spread their disease. My legacy shall perish with me. Self-destruct protocols have been initiated. Imminent self-destruct in T-minus five minutes. Technological progress is like an axe in the hands of the pathological Damn it! We're never gonna get off this fucking station in time! Damn it! All to hell! We were dead the moment we accepted this mission. Blackthorn screwed us just like he screwed Wolfpack. Fine. See if there's a way to stop this place from blowing. 